focus. Yeah. It's focused. Good morning, guys. So it is Sunday today. Yeah, we missed yesterday. <laughs> missed yesterday completely because of the weather. It doesn't make sense. Um, so let's just give you an update what we have done. We um, Friday night we went to the Velvet Coast Yeah, the new Witherspoon. Yes. And had some dinner. Pizza. You had pizza. I had the. I think it's the ultimate burger. Yeah. Or something like that. But we did take pictures, so they're going for you right now. Um, yesterday we at the Pleasure Beach all day. Yeah. Most of the day. Most of the day. Very windy, very wet. Horrible. Horrible. So that's why we didn't do any vlogging yesterday. Mm -hmm. So for that I apologise about. But last night we went to Yadin Way, which is yeah. a Brewers Fair. Brewers Fair, just um, it's attached to a Premier Inn just at the back of Blanco. It's really nice. By self station? Self station? Yeah, by self station. About five minute walk from where we're stopping the Langroyd. <coughs> um, I had the Mediterranean mixed grill, which was lamb kofters, chicken skewers, rice. Almost. Hummus, um, the tzatziki. tzatziki sauce, and like a Mediterranean salad. It was very nice. And what did you have? I had the what did I have? The Yorkshire, the beef Yorkshire roll, the, like that, wrap. That. Sorry, I've had that before though. I've put it in a vlog before. Yeah, and I know. <laughs> she was. You were going to change. I was going to change. I was going to get some other chicken, but you can get that anywhere. So you fancy? So we but changed. It's only Bruce Fair that does the wrap, so we fancy the wrap. And we did pictures of that. And we did pudding. And well. we did put. Oh, did we did pudding as well. We didn't take a picture of No, we did, I did. We had the same. Yeah. We had toffee, toffee apple waffle mm. with cookie dough ice cream. Cookie dough ice cream. So what I do, I'm going to put those butchers in for you now. This morning we've just been to the Pleasure Beach yeah. just to do the RSs with the World Coastal Club. Yeah, we we did, did the Big Dipper and the, Nation, the Grand National. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Very bumpy, very bumpy. Very bumpy. Um, today we're just Not good a, on a food. No, we're just kind of a chill out day today. We're going to go to the range. Yeah. I don't think we'll vlog in there. No, we might do. We might do a little bit. We'll see. Then we're going to go to the piers. But as we're just walking towards the prom, it's actually the Blackpool Marathon. So I'm going to spin you around and just give you a quick show of what's who's running in so we see any weird people dressed up let's have a look i must say fair play to them yeah it's quite a nice day for running though, it's not a too bad day it's not too it's quite windy it's windy it's chilly but it's not yesterday was baltic mm, yeah and it's not too hot for them so fair play to them well someone's already walking that's never good is it I think she, she looks pretty fit, Rob. Yeah, she's just, maybe just having a breather. Oh, she's off again. But fair play. Hi guys, so we are we've just been to the range. I didn't do much, any vlogging in there. But what do you think of it? Yeah, I quite liked it. You didn't you were in that bus about it, were you? No, I prefer Dobbies. I like the home stuff though. Home stuff's quite nice. Um we are right next to Bloomfield Road. Um which if you're football fans, you'll know it's the home of Blackpool. Blackpool Football Club. There's actually a hotel attached as well. A few years ago, two years ago? I don't know. Three years ago, we did a tour. Um, we weren't vlogging at the time and I was out on the Thursday night with your friends you weren't you arrived got a wee bit tipsy and the Friday night was a complete write-off Friday day was a complete write-off um, I would do it again wouldn't drink the day before and just really enjoy myself but I'm just going to show you the um, the parking tariff here because it's actually we're how far away from the Pleasure Beach do you think? Mm -hmm. a mile? No. two miles? 
made my, my own mile and a half just to show you the difference in parking so the pleasure beach for one day hours parking is 18 pounds baby we say so this one for 12 hours is tenner. yeah you've got to walk a bit of way um it's actually not that far you can't actually see where we are the, it's probably here a mile away give you so there's blackpool behind you might just see it you can't really see it just here is the blackpool tower so we're about halfway i reckon a bit further than halfway less than halfway to the tower oh really I thought we'd actually walk, walk through than we have. I think it's because we're walking behind the prom. I'm losing all aspect of where I are. Um, so, Ash reckons we're about three quarters of a mile from the Pleasure Beach. So for 10 pounds for 12 hours, it's not that bad. But if you've got kids, it's still quite a walk. And I'm guessing if you plan it wrong and you park here, this I'm guessing this car park will be used during the football. Um, how busy Blackpool gets for the football in the stadium? No idea. So bear that in mind if you are going to park here, guys. Okay, guys. So we are currently outside North Pier. I think this is the oldest one in Blackpool, is it not? Um, he goes, oh, you just have to pay to come on here, but you don't have to pay anymore. He goes, oh, the way down. And I'm going to take you as far as I can go. Ash might want to go down the edge. I don't think you can go. I don't think you can actually anymore, but we'll try. But as you'll go out, because as you can see, the sea's out. Not under that bit of here. Um, if the sea's in, this one doesn't like it. Let's see how she copes. Can't be anybody. So you read though, because there's a sunset lounge and there's a theatre. Why is it at the end of the pier? People who have performed <coughs> at the. <coughs> Lily Savage. Lily Savage, yeah. The Sabbath, Brian Connolly, Bruce Forsyth, Freddie Starr, Paul Daniels, Des O'Connor. Welcome and Wise have all performed here, guys. This is where a lot of comedians start, I think, really, isn't it? Yeah. So we're just on the way down to the bottom of the We just found this lovely bar, it's called Octoberfest. Look at it guys, it's beautiful. How are you coping? One thing you will notice guys if you come down, there is some flowers. And the train. That runs down to the theatre. Now in regards to the flowers, that means someone's actually probably jumped off. And as you can see, if I do this with a camera, I actually won't have to do this. But it's quite a way. So yeah, people jump off and unfortunately, that's it. It's concerning that there's bits of wood there. <laughs> bits of new wood. <laughs> you can actually see through the floor as well. No, stop it. <laughs> Very lovely day today. Blue skies. So as you can see, the Blackpool North Pier opened in 1863. I'm going to guess this wood is not from 1863, because as you can see, there is new, <laughs> there is some new wood. <laughs> so they do repair it when it gets. How do they know what bit needs this bit lot. This got rotten lot. Suppose it gets rotten, they'll repair it. There's quite a bit of rotten, but they are, they are making it nice again with these with these uh, 
tables down the middle, you can just chill out. You know? Next belong is central, we'll go in there in a minute. Okay guys, this is the carousel bar, and as you can see it's actually a carousel, so you the bar's behind it, which we're gonna go to in a second. Sun is shining guys, beautiful. Blackpool Tower. Blow Blackpool. So it is. So when we come next time, we're coming in June, aren't we? We're going to do some more things other than the Pleasure Beach. We're actually going to do Pleasure Beach at all. We're going to do the dungeon. Blackpool Dungeon, we're going to do Blackpool Tower and the eye at the top. So I'll take you up there. Actually, you won't, because you'll give the tower a bit, but you won't go up the left. We're going to go to Man Two Swords. And we're going to see the Centre. And we're going to go to the zoo. Yeah. All of these things we have done before, but not with you. So you'll be coming with us. It'll be quite strange doing my Mount Two Swords. We might not take you all the way, but obviously introduce it, do pictures, I think, and then put the pictures in. Because vlogging around Mount Two Swords, everyone be in the way, and I don't think it'll work personally. But we won't know till we try. So the next pier we're going to go to, guys, we're going to walk along the front a little bit, past the tower, and on to Central Pier. We're going to try and get all three done today. Well, maybe not all three, maybe not South Pier, we did that already before on Friday, but we wouldn't have a camera with us then. But I really can't believe how nice it is today compared to yesterday. Beautiful sunshine, are you having a nice day? I've got my sunglasses on. So you're like me, I have transitions today. First time I've actually I've probably used them though. No, we were changing yesterday. Yeah. But it's nice not having to switch and I don't have my cap on either. So, always good. Right guys, so the bit we're about to walk on is known as the comedy carpet. It's not, you can't really see it from down here. Uh, it's full of quotes and things that everyone has performed at, I think, where they perform? They perform somewhere at Blackpool, haven't they? Yeah. People have been on this. But it is... Little, little small quotes. So... There's one. There's loads, guys, as you can see. But when I'm up there, in June, up there, on the glass floor, you'll see it better. I think we should extend it because obviously there's more comedians now performed here than this, but actually having a reach she's feeling very warm today, she's got a coat off. Rosy toasty. Okay, this guy guys, this building right in front of me, this is the RNI lifeboats. And it is good that they are in. It means they're not saving everybody's life. Um you can donate, it is voluntary. I used to wear uh, scuba dolls I didn't know quite a bit about them so you can actually go in the shop as well and see the boats maybe we'll pop in so as I was saying outside guys you can actually come in so these are the lifeboats for Blackpool and they get used because we just saw outside there was a um, distress call on the 24th of April 23rd of April so not so long ago at five past in the morning I thought someone was in the sea at the Metropole Hotel which is just Bit north of North Pier. So they're all ready to go, and then they've got the call centers down in the sea. But, so we're all ready to go out. They have to get pulled out by a tractor because they've got to go down the ramp into the sea. Yeah, all ready to go.
Hi right, guys. We're now on Central Pier. <laughs> Second pair of the day. Tide is still out, so we're going to go for a stroll. We are going to try and find the ice bar, which Ash is so advertised. It's somewhere on this pier. Don't know where. I'm very close. Don't they say there's so, yeah, I don't really know where this is. So, it's going to hop. There's a Mathis Ferris wheel on this pier as well. As you saw on the north, which is just over there. When you're, when you're here, yeah. <laughs> We've never done this, and I don't think we'll ever will do this. Um, but there's a price that's coming up, so I will show you that in a second for all the lights. Okay guys, we're back off Central Pier. The bar we're looking for wasn't there. So this one, I don't know where she is, behind me. No, I'm not there. I'm not here anywhere, no. Got it horribly wrong. And it's actually really warm today and we've got coats on, hoodies, jeans. This is more of a short, shorts and flip-flop kind of day. Yeah, I'm not, and you see that. I didn't mingle because it was meant to be horrible. And well, it's not horrible, so when we come in June, we are going to find the ice bar. And that, she promises. So we are now going to head back, I think. We're going to go via... Rock shop. And... It's ice cream time. Ice cream time. Nothing too big for lunch, because we are going out with John and Jane tonight for an Indian. As we always do when we come to Blackpool, one on Sunday night. Um, so that would be good fun. And then he still needs to do a vlog of the hotel at some point. Probably tomorrow now though, because people will come and go and tomorrow there's nobody there. Except does two, I think. And I'll stop in tonight. Is anyone else stopping tonight at the hotel? No, I don't think so. It's like no Asta. So yeah. So maybe we'll go and see the museum if he's open. No, it's open on Sundays, but maybe they'll also be making some rock at the rock shop. So, we'll find out. So the pub is still closed, guys, because the marathon's still going on. But there's, there's a um, engineering tram coming. I really don't know what that does. Obviously engineering, but what? Did they check the line? It's not connected to anything. So how's he running? I mean, he does go up to connect it because there's like a little thing Aye. in there. Picking, uh, picking a workman up. How crazy. That's run by engines, look. It's run by engines because it's actually not connected to the wire. Smell it, can't you? Yeah. You can see the diesel coming out of the back as well. It's the boat tram. He's going to turn to the tower. He goes from the tower to... South Pier. But the minute he's off to the tower. Right guys, so we've just been to Notuanis. No Notuanis, no Artemis. Don't know how you say it. I had my banana split, as always, and you had... I did smell that. So we took photos as we always do, so I'm going to put those for you in right now.
So we're now just on our way back. We're going to chill out for a bit. Maybe have a, a cup of tea in the bar with John and Jane. I might give you a quick tour of the hotel. We'll see.